you guys it's that time of the year and this is our 4th of July fireworks stash and uh, we're first going to begin with the 500 gram cakes uh, this right here is Daring Debra it's 16 shot it's kind of like a willow effect it shoots about four at a time four different times very good cake I'll be posting a preview of that on my channel this is a fairly new cake from Alien. It's called No Vacancy. And it is 500 grams, 57 shots. Very cool effect. Um, crackling mine to red, green, and yellow cross set. Cross set is a really cool effect. Check this out on YouTube. Uh, brocade Wave, and then a bunch of other shit. So that's No Vacancy. And then we got Hot Fun in the Summer Time. Uh, I actually have no idea what the hell this one does, but uh, it's 500 grams, 38 shots. So, yeah. Fuck yeah. And then, uh, this is the rest of the very tiny stash. Uh, and I am going to start with these rockets right here, and my buddy is going to proceed. So, so go these ahead. rockets are uh, huge brakes. Goes very high. Very colorful. I would think... I think they're one of the best biggest break rockets that I've seen yet. And do you want to explain Grand Canyon? Oh yeah, Grand Canyon. So Grand Canyon has is 200 gram cake, 10, 16 shots, um, very bright, shoots one at a time, pretty good cake for 200 grams. And then he's also going to explain Firefly. So Firefly, as it says in the box, big breaks. It has very huge breaks, almost willows, They're kind of loud. 16 shots, 500 gram cake. All really good. Right. And any others? Oh, this is the Pagodas. Uh, so, it's the real difference between Pagodas and Excaliburs is that the Pagodas, um, they tend to have a more of a strobe effect on the shells. So, if you like strobe effects, Pagodas are the way to go. All right. So, that was my buddy. And uh, here we continue. Um, I'm going to start with these. Uh, this is called Homeboy Section. And it has a very cool glittering effect and it packs a big freaking punch for 200 grams. And uh, there are two missiles here that I threw in. I'm not sure what they do, but I do know missiles go very high up. And they're pretty cool. And <laughs> um, these are some uh, bottle rocket grosses right here. This is a black cat gross, the classic that you gotta have. Silver fox, which is essentially the same thing as uh, that right there, except this has a, like a glittering silver tail. And these are the very cheap, like generic, you know, bottle rockets. And then we got some crackling Roman candles. Uh, here, you know what? I'll just pull it right out. So this is like that. It's from Brothers. Brothers is a great brand of fireworks. Um, I haven't done these candles yet, uh, but they're pretty heavy, so I'm expecting a lot from them. Then we have the Starlight Candle. Uh, these are really awesome. These have a very vibrant color to them, and then a nice report. I uh, highly recommend Starlight Candles. I haven't done a cherry on top. It does have like a report and, you know, just explosion, I guess. Very cool. Um, these are generic Chinese candles. They're crackling. They're a piece of shit, but that's all they had. If you want crackling candles, I highly recommend Area 51 brand. Um, these are probably the best Roman candles I've ever done. They're called oh, they're Screaming awesome. Fish. Really awesome. Even my buddy thinks they're cool. How awesome do you think they are? <laughs> the best Roman candles. Um, they spin out and whistle and effects. Yes. So, uh, if you want to see what this does, just type it on YouTube. It's called Screaming Fish Candle. Very fucking cool. So, um... These are some other rockets, uh, Air Blaster from Window on the Top, Great Grizzly, another Window, oh no, actually this is Brothers, um, and then these are Sky Defenders, and then more uh, from Brothers. So these are just a few rockets we're going to be testing out, and uh, this one is called Old Ironsides. Now this one shoots two shots at the same time simultaneously. 30 shots total. 30 shots total. 
and uh, it has a very cool glittering effect. Check it out on YouTube if you haven't seen it. The heat is on from Winda. Nice glittering effect and um, mind shell effect. Yes. Conniption, very sick. Three whistling shots and double reports after that. These are good on a regular day. Sky Shooter from Winda. Great cake, 100 shots, good quality, good color. Roundup is beautiful. Uh, it doesn't have any crackling or color. It's just a nice gold willow effect. And then... Um, I'm sorry. Go for it. What was that? So Matrix Pyro. Um, we were surprised by that. Actually, we saw how uh, the willows, it was bright, and it had that green effect. had that strobing. Yeah. So um, the willows were pretty long and deep. And it does have a go-getter effect. Um, every green like uh, star yeah. effect so if you don't know what go getter is it means the star kind of just starts to fly off into its own direction it's really cool check that out on YouTube now we have the shells of vengeance these are from uh, alien I have not personally done them but maybe my buddy can tell me how good they I are. used them once one of the first times I got into fireworks and I love them so um, I can't tell the difference between X cows because I forgot but I just remember they were they're really well. Seems like they come with a bunch of effects too. We have four boxes of them. Heck yeah. And then we have these uh, value packs in the back. American Fun and House Party. Um, any feedback on that? Um, from, what it looks like, from what it looks like, the American Fun has better... Um, it has like about three different single huge shot um, breaks. And then the cakes look better too. Yeah, they're great for the kids. They're kind of great for beginners. Um, like he was saying, it has really cool single shot tubes. This single shot one is number five. Um, there you go. So it's pretty good. I like them. I highly recommend it. Um, and let's see what else we did not cover. Of course, everyone has to have their Excalibur shells. These are the classic best canister shells, in my opinion. Number one in the world, just like I was saying. So, that is pretty much our 2015 fireworks stash, and we will hopefully be making a 4th of July video soon. So, if you like this stash and you want to see this stuff in action, you gotta check out the 4th of July video. It should be coming up maybe in December, so be patient. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, feel free to comment. And uh, have a great 4th of July.